Hi, uh, Phil. Hello. Best known as Phil Limit, <laughs> the founder of Evernote. Um, we are uh, very happy to have you at the next is our uh, web scene. Oh. And uh, we would love to know more about you as a person. <laughs> well, thank you. And then, of course, about Evernote. So, please, uh, how did you start? Um, well, we wanted to just create a, a product that, that we ourselves wanted. We wanted something to uh, give the whole world a better memory uh, because we really needed it ourselves. Uh, so uh, we've had uh, different different teams working on this problem for for many years, uh, but we thought that about five years ago the technology was just getting to a point where it was possible to do this for a billion people, uh, and uh, that was it. So we just uh, we started building it, and uh, we got very fortunate that. Uh, our timing was right. Okay, but uh, uh, was it based on a need that you had yourself? Absolutely, yeah. We, we really, Evernote is, is uh, my third company and uh, many of the other founders have, have uh, started uh, other companies before, so it's not a, it's not a new thing for us. And uh, we decided, our, you know, all of our previous companies we, we sold, we, we made those companies for somebody else. And uh, at, at Evernote, we thought, okay, now this company we want to make to keep. We want it, we want it to be for us. Uh, so right from the beginning, it was, uh, it was about building something that we needed, and it was about building a company that we would always want to hold. Okay, so basically, uh, if you can describe Evernote for our lecture, um, what is it exactly? Well, it's an external brain. It's, uh, it's something that helps you be smarter and remember everything, and uh, you know, be a happier, more productive person. Okay, so well, what are the most of the people are using it? Which outside specifically? We know that uh, a lot of uh, journalists like your, your application. Yeah. Uh, is it based on it or journalists based mainly? Or well, it's really meant for uh, the modern you know, information worker. It's, it's for someone who has this very uh, information rich life. Uh, someone who's always thinking about work, uh, but also always thinking about you know, food and friends and personal stuff. Uh, really, this mixture of personal and professional. And it's great for anyone who's basically dealing with a lot of knowledge. So, journalists are a great uh, use case for us. But so are you know doctors and lawyers and designers and programmers and web professionals, uh, you know really everyone who has too much information to keep track of. Oh great! And uh, you just uh, announced about uh, uh, Evernote. Hello. Yes. So if you can t uh, tell us more about it. Well, the idea of Evernote Hello is it's a way to remember people uh, in Evernote. So I would always capture personal information in Evernote as a way to remember people I meet, and Evernote Hello just makes that better. So it's a very visual way to remember a person. I think the problem with, uh, you know, with previous address books uh, is that they're, they're alphabetical. But I, my brain doesn't work alphabetically. I don't remember people alphabetically. I remember people based on their face. You know, what do they look like? Based on the time, you know, when, when did I meet that person? And based on the context, uh, you know, where was I? And who else was there? And, and what, was I eating something? And so Evernote Hello is a way to capture the, the appearance, the chronology and the context uh, in, a, in a very easy, visual, simple way, and then put it in Evernote, so it combines the full power of Evernote with this uh, really simple, elegant uh, way of remembering people. So it's a more digital way of the this business, the business card cards. With a picture. Well, yeah, uh, something like that. Absolutely, I think the face is the is, is the most important thing because our our brains have been created to really you know recognize faces. Uh, and uh, you can also take pictures of business cards with it and, and you know, other notes. It's basically a way to get all of your information about a person uh, into, uh, into your Evernote account. Okay, so if, if I understand it, uh, you, you will uh, use the Evernote Hello, uh, you will take uh, basically a picture of me <laughs> and remembering it that I had an interview with you for with the next year. Absolutely, yeah. And, and uh, I can do it, I can enter the information or we actually made it so that it's easy to give the phone to to the person you're meeting, and they can take a picture of themselves in a really fun way. Okay. So either way. Okay, but how can I uh, uh, remember the name, or how can I search in on it if I still uh, find, uh, meet you again in, like, let's say, six months? Yeah. Well, so it's in it's in Evernote, so you can search by any of the ways by on the map, based on what else was happening, based on name, based on okay. any because of the information. Okay. Because we have like a visual recognition of a person, right. but we do still forget where we met him. Yeah. So how does it work? Well, it puts everything into Evernote, so all of the all of the Evernote searching okay. is available. So you can do keyword searching, you can do looking at a map, okay. you can search for other things and you know okay. find things in context. You can tag things, however you want. Great, great. So uh, do you have maybe some other features that you're working on? Well, you know, we're we're really trying. We've just launched Evernote Food, okay. which is a similar idea for capturing all your food memories. Okay. Uh, and the idea is really we want to build the essential tools 
for, uh, for the information-rich life. So everything that you need to do every day to get something accomplished. So we think there's many great technologies for a diversion. If you want to connect with friends or play games, there's many, many great apps, many technologies for that. But there is not really a lot of great stuff for actually doing something productive. So we want Evernote to be the way that you do something productive in your life. Thank you very much, Phil. Thank you so and, much. Uh, good luck with everything and uh, hope to see some very new things in Evernote. Thank you and good luck with your project. It sounds Thank really you. exciting. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.